story starts with this computer. This is actually a recycled computer that has a new motherboard in it now. It's got an 8 processor AMD and it's got 32 what is it? 32 gig of memory. That's that red stuff over there. And then we have two video cards and that's a second drive. It booted off of this drive and it's running ESX, which is VMware ESX. So there's a hypervisor at the very end, at, or at the very bottom, and which is ESX 5.0. So it runs multiple virtual machines on top of it. And we use this little Windows XP machine in order to be able to get into it via a web browser. And here we can see this is how much CPU has been taken for all the machines right gosh can you read that right there you can see um, the virtual machines that are in there right now we have only the Windows 7 machine is running you see the little green on there that's actually running on a on a um, remote desktop connection over on this Macintosh so this Macintosh has got a second monitor right there that then runs this, which is the XP machine. You see, that's actually a virtual machine, and I've actually am running the Sony um, PMB. I'm not sure what that's called. What that actually is. Um, see, as I move my hand on this mouse, it moves this one over here, and so PMB. Picture motion browser or something like that, maybe? Yeah, I think. And then I'm connected to the to this camera via the USB port in the back of the hypervising machine. So that's how that all works. And then this shows us this is a Raspberry Pi right here, which is a $35 computer with a keyboard and a mouse next to it and it is running a terminal into the ESX and showing us the percentage that Windows 7 is taking. There's my Windows 7 64-bit image and it is taking 4.95 percent of the CPU out of 800 since it's got eight processors in there. So there you have it.